guys, we're back together today with a beautiful video for you and for us because it's going to be a good memory to keep for us. So as you noticed from the thumbnail and from the title and everything, Coro is pregnant. I'm having a baby. You are. We're having a baby. Yeah, but it's coming out of me. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, but I planted in there. <laughs> Still coming out of me, but anyway. Yeah. <laughs> right, I guess you're right. But having a we baby. are having it. But it's going to be my baby as well, so. Yeah. So we have waited quite a while to release this video because we were waiting to tell lots of people because we wanted to go to Italy to yes. tell Ricardo's family and we weren't doing that till quite a bit later on. Yeah. So we couldn't. When did we find out? Like the beginning of June. The end of no, June. The, the very June. end of June. We yes. Found out. <laughs> because I went to Italy. I was on my own. Coral couldn't come with me because she had to work well let me describe it from okay. the beginning okay yeah. so i went to pick ricardo up from the airport yeah well while i was going to pick him up from the airport i decorated the room so i put because you like, found out that night didn't you yeah i found out that day yeah <laughs> like so i was like hmm, i out. haven't come on my period <laughs> <laughs> not being wrong through that but you know that's how it is <laughs> and i was like i'm definitely late and i'm never ever so I'd already bought like baby stuff. It is planned. We did plan to have the baby. Basically, I bought the baby stuff. I bought pink and blue balloons, stuck them on the ceiling, blew them up, stuck them on the ceiling, and set out the baby stuff on the bed. And then I went to get Ricardo from the airport. His plane was late. He didn't land until midnight. As and it's usual, like from Italy. An hour and a half away. <laughs> so. But yeah, yeah, as usual from Italy. And all the way home, Ricardo was like, we're never gonna have a baby. It's never gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, because in the first month, <laughs> We tried it the first month and I was and it didn't succeed and I was well disappointed. I was like, oh, that's so the sad. first month, you know. I know. I was already sad. But I was really sad. I was really looking forward to having a baby. <laughs> yeah, after Ricardo's like little disaster on the way home, came in the room. I turned all the lights off purposefully and went in the bedroom straight away. And he came in and just stood there and he was like looking up. And then I turned the lights on and then he was still just looking up. And I went, we're having a baby. <laughs> And I I'm exploded. Or something. Yeah. yeah. I was re I was really excited and I don't know, I couldn't I couldn't think straight anymore. I was like just literally just thinking about that. And the day after I was working as a student ambassador at the university, it was an open day and I remember every time I had a new group coming in, I was like, sorry guys, I'm just daydreaming because I just found out I'm having a baby and I'm never going to see you again. So if you guys are cool, you can know. <laughs> I, did tell, I did tell quite a lot of people, to be honest. We didn't really 100% wait for that, you know, three month first scan yeah, mark because I think if something was to happen in that time, you would tell people anyway and people would find out. So why would you not just tell them before? Yeah, we so, just... Not everybody, I didn't tell everybody before. So in June, we found out and and we went to tell Cora's family first. That was in July. That yep. was like a, that same week. So it literally was the end of June. I wanted to do it in a really obviously awkward and weird way. Because Cora is very awkward <laughs> and weird. But that's so, how we like it. I was researching what the size of the baby would be. And it was the size of an apple seed. So I thought we had like all these different ideas. But this is the idea that we went with. So I thought oh, I'll just eat an apple. But I'll have pre-eaten an apple. You're I'll have the apple seed. And basically when everybody was outside. Because it was July. So it was nice. Nice for her. Everybody's outside. I went, did you know this apple seed is the size of my baby? Or the size of our baby yeah, or something yeah, like this? Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. Jackie, my sister-in-law, she got it straight away. My mum earlier that day had asked me if I was pregnant. So... <laughs> She's probably expecting yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> Which is weird because she's never asked me if I'm pregnant apart from that one time. And of course I said no. <laughs> no. And then my brother, he didn't really believe me, did he? No, yeah. yeah Curtis thought it was a joke. Yeah. But then he saw me recording it was like, he's recording it, so yeah. it's true. <laughs> and then my dad didn't hear the first time. And then my sister didn't hear either. So <laughs> <laughs> but that's okay, we just went and told them. And then along after, <laughs> like three months after, yeah. we managed to go to Italy because it was my sister's baptism and we took the chance to go there and tell my family as well. So we got my mum's her favourite chocolate, her favourite English chocolate and we put inside of the box a picture of the scan and we've written on... My mum can't oh. be the only one getting fat. Yeah. There you go. It took her a while to understand because she first laughed thought there was something funny on it, but yeah. she and couldn't read it. And there was a picture of the scan as well, did you yeah. say that? Yeah, yeah, I did. Yeah, okay. But <laughs> she couldn't actually read it, she needed glasses, so she said... Your brother noticed laugh. though, because... But my brother was behind Paolo him. looked and he looked at us and he's like, 
<laughs> yeah. And then we've got we've got my mum taking the glasses on and she's actually read it and she I don't know, she wasn't shocked. She, she just burst into tears. Yeah, she burst into tears. She couldn't she opened her mouth and it was open for a long time, I remember. And then your dad was on the other side of the room who was like, All I can hear is her screaming <laughs> or something like that. Or she's just crying. Yeah. Yeah, it's like what's going on? What's going on? Because it was, was on the other side of the living room. Yeah, then we told our whole family as well. My my family. That's Family. The extended family, uncles, uncles and, and grums, grums, grumps, yeah, grumps, grandparents and stuff grumps. like that. We did it because we were taking a picture all together. So I got everyone to be in place, in position, and I was taking a picture. I was like, "All right, are you guys ready? Yes, okay, cool." Cora's pregnant. <laughs> That's what we, how we told them, and they were all like went crazy. Yeah. Jumping you kind of got that on video, but yeah, but the phone was really weird. It fell, yeah, and then it stopped recording. I can try to put that on there <laughs> and in a video, yeah. um, but it's it's really weird because the phone kept falling off. Every time that everyone was going to, to add Coral and, yeah, and go crazy. I don't know why I did that. But anyway, we tried. Dideme se ce sede. Si. A posto. Coral incinta. It's going to be due on the 3rd of March, that's, yeah. what, that's what they said. Oh, yeah, 3rd of March 2020. Yeah. In the next video we'll just talk about a bit... We'll reveal of... the gender of the baby! <laughs> <laughs> okay, in the next video we'll reveal the gender of the baby. So, stay tuned and let us know what you think about it and what your guesses are. If it's a boy or a girl, let us know and we'll discuss a little You literally don't have very bit. long to tell us. Yeah, really you don't have that long because probably like, <laughs> on Wednesday or... Yeah. Thursday, we'll let you know. Yeah, we, you don't have long, so if you want to so, tell us, tell us now. Yeah, so write and hold your peace. Comment below, comment below, and we'll, we'll see how yeah. many people. I got hope right. you've enjoyed this little comeback. Yep, yeah, and hopefully we'll um, be back more often. We'll see how Coral feels. If you guys are supportive and like to share your love with Coral, Coral. Uh, 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 so we'll see you guys in the next video peace. of the gender review. Bye.